Hello and welcome to another uh, uh, Java tutorial for uh, LaTeX for uh, Java developers. And uh, we said that uh, LaTeX is basically a command line tool that uh, has lots of, uh, that comes as a package and it, at the top level, it has a type setting system. So PDF LaTeX, Z LaTeX, these are the command line tools or type setters that you feed your raw tech file and these are not WYSIWYG, so these are not, uh, you cannot do, for example, drag and drop uh, a, a photo or a picture inside your LaTeX document, right? And uh, LaTeX was essentially developed for uh, scientific writing because scientific writing usually includes lots and lots of equations, right? And uh, and then uh, you really want to put them in a very nice format with a very font size, uh, font size or font style. And for example, I showed you this LaTeX eat, right? And all the LaTeX commands start with the backward slash or backslash. So beta equals f of x, for example. So if this is a raw text, right, raw string, and I feed it to LaTeX and it creates a very beautiful math uh, equation with a very nice font, right? And then the, the latex commands for writing equations, actually it's uh, so powerful and so easy to use that even uh, WYSIWYG, uh, most of the WYSIWYG uh, uh, basically typesetters or word processors also support it, especially Microsoft Office, right? Even Microsoft Office allows writing equations using latex commands because that's very easy and that's very easy to use and easy to understand, right? And for example, we can create a math environment in Microsoft Office using uh, control equal or command equal if you're on Mac. So let me just bring up Microsoft Office. And uh, if I hit command and equal, uh, sorry, control and equal, it creates a math environment, right? And later we see that the LaTeX also has the same concept of environments. Uh, uh, so this is a, a graphical environment and if I want to type something I can say backslash beta this is exactly the same command as in LaTeX if when I hit a space it automatically converts it to the mathematical symbol beta equals f of x for example right or f of uh, zeta right now obviously Microsoft Word has some nice features that uh, we don't immediately have in LaTeX. You have to write some extra code in LaTeX that does the job. For example, if I want to create a fraction, I can just type two over f of x. When I hit a space, it automatically converts it in a very nice format, right? But uh, in LaTeX, you have to create a fraction environment or a fraction code, right? But as you can see, the commands of LaTeX for creating a scientific writing or equations is very popular and they're even supported in LaTeX. And that's a great help because once you learn the LaTeX commands for writing equations, you can immediately use them in, uh, for example, Microsoft Office, Microsoft Word or Microsoft PowerPoint, which is very nice feature, right? Upon uh, pressing a spacebar, so you write backslash beta, this is a LaTeX command. As soon as you hit a spacebar, the Microsoft Office, Microsoft Word processes these and replaces with the symbol beta. The LaTeX command automatically translates in Microsoft Word. Math environment has two modes, inline and display, and we will show that LaTeX also has the same idea of having uh, math environments uh, inline and display. Inline means uh, you already have some text file, so uh, Hello, uh, this is this is a equation, and you want to put some equation here about some phenomenon, for example, right? So how do you write equation here? Again, the same idea. You can create a inline math environment. Control equal, and uh, let's say uh, x squared plus y equals one, right? As you can see, this is in line with the text, so its font size is typically. Uh, I mean, the spacing around the equation is typically adjusted so that uh, uh, um, so that it fits into one line. So if you create a fraction, for example, you see it decreases the font size, right? And now the entire spacing or the insets of the line increases. But you can avoid it by not pressing a space like this one, right? But the other mode of equation is display mode. Display mode is uh, you create you, in, you are on the new line. There is no text here, and then you hit control and equal, right? So this is uh, uh, 
uh, this is the display mode and you see the fraction didn't uh, uh, reduce and it just increased the entire insets the vertical insets to hit this fraction without reducing the font size right so for example if you write this and hit a space bar and start continuing writing text it automatically converts it into a inline mode right so if i remove this text and remove that space it automatically converts it back to the display mode and if i hit this equation tab you can see we have professional linear normal text and then we have this equation uh, that has some predefined equation if I set this to linear it doesn't convert the fraction doesn't basically translate the latex command if I say professional it translates the latex latex commands normal text it doesn't uh, convert it to the basically uh, 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 like uh, italic font size right because math variables are typically italic normal text is typically not italic now if I select this uh, environment and click on this arrow in Microsoft Office, I can select between change to inline. So it automatically changes to inline and I can start continuing writing text, for example. If I select this and then uh, change to display, you see the display is always has to be in an entire line and the text goes to the next line. So these are the concepts that we will see also LaTeX does basically the same idea, right? I just wanted to show you that uh, even in uh, the latex commands for writing uh, scientific equations and uh, it are so popular that even WYSIWYG applications such as Microsoft Office, Microsoft Word Processor, or even Microsoft PowerPoint. So at some point, uh, they added uh, the inserting the equations, the support of equations in PowerPoint. So if I go to insert and then select uh, um, let's see uh, i create a empty text insert select equation and now i have equation environment similar to what we have in word but there is no concept of inline and display in powerpoint here because in powerpoint everything is supposed to be in the display mode so i can write beta and when, in, when i hit a space it automatically converts the latex command uh, to uh, uh, to uh, to the actual symbol right so this was a brief introduction to what the latex commands are. We will definitely look into more details of that. I hope you enjoyed this lecture. Please stay tuned and I'll see you in the next one.